Welcome, my angels. It's Robin here with your daily spirit message reading for Sunday, October 6th. And I'm using the stunning Shadowscape Tarot to do this reading. And I am calling on my guides to help and participate and assist me in channeling messages from the universe for you today, for the collective. And that's you. Okay, so let's have a little card here. We'll start off with a little card. We have the five of swords, but it looks like people that maybe from previous experiences, maybe they were against you on something. I feel like you're going to have new supporters in your life, okay? And they're just going to be, and I'm getting the words like weirdly defensive of you. So if somebody's coming back in contact with you or maybe you've had some sort of a run-in with somebody and you don't want to communicate with them again, it looks like they've had some sort of a change of heart. Um, and they see where they have been wrong. I don't see an apology coming in, but I do see a change in behavior, okay? And it, it's, it's like they have decided that they want to become with the strength card, somebody who is a massive supporter of you, and they just really see that they misinterpreted your energy. So I think this is gonna be really amazing. And for some of you, it could be somebody that is in your family that maybe you've been battling with for a little while or a coworker, whatever it is, like it's gonna be such a welcome relief that you don't have to <clears throat> limit your exposure to that person anymore. One of my guides said that they might actually apologize, but don't hold your breath. <laughs> I'm going to write that down. Hold on. <laughs> so we were saying like, maybe, maybe you'll get an apology. Maybe you won't. But you know what? The best apology is changed behavior. It is not somebody coming up and saying, oh, I'm so sorry about that. And then they just continue being a total <laughs> jerk. <laughs> Let's go with it. So change behavior and it will be very, very, very obvious. Um, and they could be offering you just a new way of life, you know, with the full card and they could be opening up doors for you. I feel like this person was battling against you in rooms that you were not in, which is kind of shady. So, I mean, you can decide if you want to forgive this person or not, or you can be really reluctant about this person and that's okay too, because they're probably going to need a little bit of time and grace to win back your trust and faith because it's really difficult, but you'll feel the energy. It's kind of difficult to forgive somebody if they like totally stabbed you in the back or made you look bad or gossiped about you. Um, but we do have the chariot here. So you should be able to feel their energy too and feel that there is a really deep sincerity in it. Okay. So I just wouldn't give them a key to your house or anything like that. I mean, start small and see if they're going to live up to the promises. Um, like, especially, I think it's so hard if like somebody was pushing against you or talking dirt about you to other people. That's the tough thing because angel number 333 just went by. Um, and I feel like you've known this person for a long time with the page of cups. And this could be sort of a long-standing rift. But I do see it coming to a close. But I, you know, the, it could seem really, really sketchy. But the Queen of Swords is saying, you know, everything is going to be okay. This person is going to turn into somebody that is a protector of you. Okay? And I think this is great news. I think this is amazing. But I feel your skepticism. I do. So we have the Eight of Wands. So it's just letting things go. It is like you can see with the character, or maybe you can't, I don't know. Um, just letting things go. I have a massive sneeze here. I almost did not make the pause button. And the last thing I want to do is sneeze on camera because I could just see people going and rewinding it and going, oh, that looks so gross. But anyway, <laughs> let things go to the best of your ability. Try not to hold a grudge, but this person will prove that you can now trust them. And I am going to go. All right. Take care. Bye.